Hello there everyone, I'm Bodine Victoria. Welcome to my kitchen and this is my pot. This is the official final episode of Bodine Pot for the year 2020 and we are going out with a celebration. Today's episode of Bodine Pot is sponsored by Commonwealth Brewery Limited, 700 Wines and Spirits and features none other than Vauve Clicquot, Brut Yellow and Rosé. Did I say that right? Today on Bodine Pot, we're gonna be making some New Year's Eve kind of, I don't wanna call them a canapé, but we're gonna make small plates. So the small plate that we're gonna be doing with the Vauclico Brut is going to be a Bahamian fish puff pastry pear concoction. Then we're gonna move on to the rosé. We're going to pair the rosé with some berries, some fresh cream and Bahamian pound cake and put it together and make ourselves, you know, a trifle. And we're going to enjoy it. So if you're ready, let's go. We're going to start our first recipe with the Vauve Clicquot Brut. What we're gonna be doing is we are going to be playing off of the lemony notes, the green pear and apple and citrusy kind of deliciousness that's in here and we're gonna pair it with our fatty fish which is our grouper. I have the perfect recipe for this. We're gonna Bahamianize, you know, a salmon and crouté <laughs> with a little bit of grouper. We're starting today with some deliciousness. So here we have some ethically sourced Nassau grouper. And here we have the traditional salmon that you would use to accompany the brut. We're going to season the Nassau grouper with a bit of Bahamian salt and pepper. And that's literally all we're gonna do. I'm just doing it this way because I don't wanna put my hand in it. Two tablespoons of butter. Two tablespoons of shallots. If you don't have shallots, you can use red onions. Half a cup of green pear, ripe green pears. A pinch of salt. A teaspoon of crushed garlic. A teaspoon of thyme. You also have a teaspoon of dried dill. Fresh dill is better, but I only found dried dill. Now here's where we take half a cup of half and half around three tablespoons of softened cream cheese. These are greens. These are things like radicchio, and then you have some arugula, some baby spinach in here. Essentially, I really just wanted spinach, but these were all on sale for $1.99, and you all know January is a long month. So I'm just gonna coarsely chop them until we have about a cup of it. You may not need all of it, but honestly, this cream sauce is gonna be so delicious. I'm gonna put some crushed black peppercorn from my Showman e-bistro kit. Say half a tablespoon of lime juice. Finally, a quarter cup of Parmesan. Here we have one sheet of puff pastry, just by way of example. We're just gonna smooth this out, and we're gonna try to cut this into evenly sized squares. We're going to take just a little bit of that and we're gonna put it here. Then we're gonna take our piece of grouper and we're gonna rest it on top of that like that. And then we're going to take one of the other squares and we are going to cover it, okay? So either which way. So to make it easy for people like me who can't roll stuff, we're just gonna take our buttered, <laughs> our buttered muffin tin. I'm just gonna do this. Trust me, easy. You won't even be stressing yourself out, easy.
So we're going to throw two cups of blackberries, strawberries, raspberries, and um, blueberries into our pot. A quarter cup of sugar or less. It's up to you. But if you have fresh fruit, you can do this. I didn't have fresh fruit and I'm also making small batches. So these are the frozen ones. A tablespoon of lemon to this and it brightens up and improves the flavor of the berries. This is four ounces because we're adding mascarpone cream to it. Add a teaspoon of lemon zest. Also gonna add a teaspoon of vanilla because we need the flavor, the deliciousness of it. Now it's time for four ounces of mascarpone cream. You can use regular cream cheese if you want to, but this here is different all. About a quarter cup of powdered sugar. A little bit more lemon juice. And when you're done, you see how, look how nice and, look how nice and thick this is. Look at that. Mm. This is the tricky part. <laughs> now I only used this piping bag because it's so much easier. All right. A little bit of our custom cream cheese situation in there and I'm gonna throw a few pieces of delicious pound cake from Jumper Brothers or wherever in here. Okay, I'm gonna squish it down a little bit. Look at that. Look yummy, right? Nom, nom, nom. We're gonna throw, I'm gonna put some more of this delicious cream cheese situation. Let me tell y'all something. Your girl knocked it out of the park. I beat this bad. This Vauve Clico Brut pairs perfectly with this white fish, but it's a fatty white fish. And so instead of the salmon, cause I did some salmon, but it don't hit like the Koopa. We got this deliciousness. Let me, I could take one out of the oven cause my plate look pretty, hold on. Also, there were 12, I've eaten I've eaten, I've eaten three. And now it's time for dessert. For dessert, we have the Vauve Clicquot Rosé. Now let me tell you all something. I'm excited about this because I decided to pair this with a trifle. This is a pound cake, Jumper Brothers pound cake with mixed berry compote and mascarpone cream, cheese, whipped cream, trifle. So it's layers and layers and layers of deliciousness. And it goes perfectly with this rosé. So I'm gonna try it, let's see if I could. <laughs> I love it, I love that sound. Like I understand why people love it. And we are going to sample. Ooh, do I see the color on this? Gonna, oh yes, yeah, hold on. Mm. This is gonna be perfect. I have no pretty spoons yet. I have regular homemade spoons because as a regular homemade gal, right? Doing not so regular things. So I'm gonna take a little bit of this jumper. Ooh, yes, yes, yes. Nom, 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 look at that. Mm. <laughs> Goodness. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Mm. 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 Hold on. Yes. This is an exceptional pairing. The Volclico Rose has enough tartness and enough sweetness mixed in and for some reason, 
when you have it with the creamy sweetness of the mascarpone cream with along with the tartness of the berries and the sweetness of the berries and then you have the pillowy texture of that buttery pound cake let me tell you something you can't tell me that this was not made in a five-star restaurant okay welcome to Titus kitchen <laughs> Vov Clico is on sale for 20% off at your friendly neighborhood 700 wines and spirits locations nationwide. Stock up and bring the New Year's in in style. I want to say thank you guys so much for all of your love, all of your support. It's been my pleasure hanging out with you and I want you not to forget in 2021, if they ain't bringing no grocery, especially if they ain't bringing no grocery, don't let any and every body dig up in your pot. <laughs> okay, I can go eat something else now. Honey, you want the next one of these?